Good morning. Good morning. Oh, the mirror's dirty. Good morning. You got no idea. <laughs> what is the other one? It's a nice one. Oh my god. 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 <laughs> that one, or Harlow knows better. Nala does not. Quesadillas? No, that'd be nice, honey. It's okay. Where's well, the third one? Oh, she, she has, has all three. She has all three. You are a bully, girl. Let her have it. You've this been is... a you've been an only child for too long. Let her have it. <laughs> for him to realize that the world doesn't revolve all around him. Right. Hey. Hey, sister. I'm gonna make a bottle for him and put him down for a nap. Hi. He's sleepy. Hi. Hi. He's a sleepy guy. When I picked him up for you yesterday, take care. Morning beverages. And Jack is. <laughs> I'm drinking a dinner. just got ready and today is Saturday my first wedding of the year so I thought it'd be fun to vlog and it's just gonna be like a little weekend vlog because I think I'm gonna continue it on tomorrow but anyway got my all black outfit I really got to clean this mirror it's disgusting um, but I think it's gonna be pretty cold today and super windy so I've got my hair slicked back and bundled up I have three shirts on <laughs> Alrighty, I am making my last bit of like double checking everything, making sure I have everything to go. I have my gimbal stabilizer right here and the batteries and everything are charged for it. And then I mentioned this, I think in another vlog, but I ended up purchasing this new camera bag. It's called Bag Smart from the brand Bag Smart. I love it. It's waterproof, super cute. Like I love the colors very my aesthetic and I have all of my stuff already packed where I'll show you anyway so I have the two camera bodies I just purchased the Canon R6 and I'm so so excited to use it um, and then two lenses microphone charger and a battery and then I have my cards in here my gimbal batteries um another charger extra batteries all of that Oops. and then 
zip this up um, and then I have my attachment to my gimbal to make it um, a little bit easier for me to carry because it is very heavy if you can imagine having a big camera lens on top of like a stick and like try and hold it um, but yeah I love my little bag here so I have the whole top compartment empty so I'm going to put a couple snacks in here for throughout the day maybe um, a little water something like that also I love it because it has like a little attachment where you can put um, your laptop and it's extra padded and yeah it's just super cute I'm obsessed with it so I have all of my stuff in here packed like I said all my batteries and everything are fully charged my camera cards are clean um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So I'm gonna bring this into the kitchen and pack up some like snacks so I have them and um, we'll be good to go. Yay. I'm on the road. It is 12.15 now. I have about an hour and 20 minute drive, which is not bad at all. Um, with weddings, a lot of times my drive is normally about two hours or so at least, so um, today is not bad at all. It's actually in Boonville where I used to live, my life, my house before the house I live in now. Um, so, I'm very familiar with the area, but I have not been to this venue yet, so I'm excited to go there. Um, I do know the photographer, so that's nice. Um, I'm looking forward to working with her and yeah, I think it's gonna be an all-around really good day I am excited to get back into the wedding season I feel refreshed and ready to get after it um, but I'm not gonna lie I'm kind of a little sad I feel like my camera's moving <laughs> a little anxious to be leaving Callan for like a full day and I just I know Jackson's gonna handle it and they're gonna have fun and it's really good for Jackson honestly for them to just have some bonding time alone and um, I'm really grateful that I can depend on Jack to take good care of him I mean even though he's his dad and he should um, but some some dads aren't like that and so I'm very fortunate but anyway um, I have my playlist locked and loaded for this morning. I'm sorry that this road is bumpy, but I have my playlist ready to go, and I am just going to kind of chill, get my mind right, get ready for the day. I'm crossing the dam, look. The water's super rough. I don't know if you can even see it, but the water's really rough this morning because of all those storms that we had last night. Pretty crazy. Walk, smile, look at each other. Look at each other. Okay, go in for a kiss. I just realized that I did not vlog at the wedding yesterday. I got a lot of the behind the scenes stuff, so maybe I'll insert that. But um, when I came home, um, <laughs> this happened. <laughs> so we're at the vet, it's Sunday morning at 8 a.m eyebrows are jacked um and we're in Columbia at the animal hospital and Goose has fractured his leg in two spots his toe or his foot not his yeah his yeah, foot his whatever foot, not his leg. um by jumping off the back of the couch but he's okay yeah it looks kind of intense but I think it's just like so he doesn't Move it. Yeah. You have a splint. You're going to be just fine. So we're waiting on meds right now. And, uh, 
Callan's eating breakfast. <laughs> There's just a lot going on in here. Yeah, there is. to be at the grocery store. My favorite time. Also, look at these flowers. Are they not beautiful or what? They're beautiful. They're beautiful. Yeah, they are. <laughs> Prepare for a Sunday reset. <laughs> We've been up since 5 a.m. We're gonna make some iconic sandwiches. I'm gonna try the white raspberry, white chocolate raspberry, Chobani creamer. Yum! Will you grab uh, a bagel? What? Will you grab me a bagel, please? I want a whole sandwich. I want a big boy. A big boy. A big boy. We're going to need this for the eggs and for. Um, my double day. But you didn't know that. Okay, so. Didn't. Have like a little tang. I've never made hardboard eggs in my life though, so. I'm excited. I love hardboard eggs. I feel like you love them or you hate them. Yeah, babe. Wow. Have some more chips. I've had these before, this is a taste test. They're literally my biggest pregnancy craving. She came home with like 10 boxes or bags in the In the very beginning, and then towards the middle to end, I was like, yeah, I don't care. So they just sat in our fridge for a while. They're really good. And they're not that bad for you. They're 140 calories per 16 pieces. Which I don't think is bad. Would you get the meat out? I'm gonna eat a sandwich. I love a sandwich. She's a big sandwich girl. He is just laying in there wide awake, I'm pretty sure. He ain't gonna bed. It's fine, he'll probably fall asleep. His second nap, you mean? Yes, his second nap. He did not sleep very long. You want turkey? Mm hmm. Or salami? No, that salami's going bad. We need to pitch it just to be safe. Okay. I put that turkey and salami in my salad for my um, what I ate in a day video, and it was really yummy. Mm, mm, mm. Something that changes the complete dynamic of a sandwich is the bread. And I toast it on sourdough. Then you start with your mayonnaise. Look at me giving you a whole tutorial on how to make a good sandwich. We bought these thick pepperonis from Deerberg's. I didn't really film while we were in there because I just like get so overwhelmed. I love it so much. I'm overstimulated when I'm in there, but I love it. Um, but yeah, we didn't get a whole bunch of stuff, just some stuff that we needed, and we're going to make Easter cookies later, like just like Easter chocolate chip cookies, um, because I'm feeling like Easter mood, and I was saying this on our way here. Maybe an unpopular opinion, I don't know. But I feel like Easter should be more hyped than 
Christmas, personally. I love Easter. Okay. Italian sandwich, but instead of ham, I use turkey, because I have it. Yum. Freaking yum. Do you agree? <laughs> what do you not agree about? I'm not a big turkey fan. Oh. I mean, I eat it. It's not, not my first choice. It's not my first choice either, but because I'm in like honey baked ham, does no wrong. Mm hmm. You want some pepperoncinis? No, ma'am. Good. Thanks for the offer, though. I do appreciate it. Oh, does he keep losing his binky? And also, while we were at Deerberg's, I got zesty bread and butter pickles. The zesty ones are the best. Mm. Oh my god. These are so good. Now I can drink out of the jar because this is my house. Jack doesn't like pickles. So this whole jar is all me. If you can hear, Talon is way beyond his nap time, so he's fighting his sleep pretty bad. Also, Goose is being a trooper, aren't you? You're being a trooper. You honestly wouldn't even know he's hurt if he wasn't limping. Oh, <laughs> clearly, you can see he's trying to jump up. Yeah. And the girls are babying him, making him feel so loved. <laughs> yeah, aren't ya? Bone apple teeth. Yum. Got my water. I'm having a Dr. Pepper because we woke up at 5 a.m. And I need a little refresh. Also, this is my lens adapter that I need for my lens to fit my camera. That came in a little late. I was wishing it was coming in. I was hoping it was going to come in yesterday before my wedding. It did not, but that's okay. I need this. I'm going to get after it. We're going to do a house cleanup. outside and the like yard work and he also deep cleaned our grill I think we're gonna grill it tonight but I think we're also going to do these egg dyeing kits um, I got this from Target and they're so so cute I've always done these with my parents and I love these they're dinosaurs for Callan of course Callan's too little to dye eggs 
but we thought it'd be really cute and take pictures and stuff so we can show him when he gets older. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna boil some water and get these eggs going. And then here in a little bit, I think we're just gonna set it up and do it. Jack and I love doing little activities like this together. You remember my birthday vlog? We did, um, he's blowing the leaves outside if you can't hear, or if you can hear that. But um, for my birthday vlog, we did um, pumpkin carving and it was so much fun. So I think we're gonna do this tonight. And we also got stuff to make cookies. So we're gonna do that. I'm just gonna boil them for now and then we will make them later. I'm tired. I've actually woken up quite a bit. I just got done boiling the eggs. I'm gonna let them set and cool for a little bit. And while I did that, I picked up my new camera and lens and then I attached the attachment and I'm seriously loving it, you guys. I'm inserting some of the pictures and airdropping them to my phone and look at some of these pictures. I took some of Goose because I realized we hadn't announced that we got him. So I put that on Instagram and then I just kind of had some fun like taking pictures of Cal and they are so stinking cute. I'm so obsessed. Very, very good camera. We are doing the eggs outside because it's so nice. What is it, 75? Yeah. Yeah. It might be a little too bright, but I'm just going to go with it. You like it outside? Huh? It's pretty. Callan, if you're watching this in the future. Alright, now we need cool. water. And it half a cup? Just get my get a um do we have a pitcher? Yeah. Yeah, just get that and fill it. Nice. <laughs> Uh-huh. Wanna cheer us, me? Maybe. You're not even in the frame. Damn. You open that for me? No, I'm the one that opens them. Or you're the one that opens A fun fact about us, um, we always, I don't know why. I do it because my dad did it when I was kid. I've done this since I can remember. We always turn our tabs to the left. Mm -hmm. Both of us. It's the weirdest thing. I've never met anybody that does that. And I, it was kind of nice to do it because nobody knew, you always knew what drink was yours. Yep. And think, now. Yeah, I think like college, one of my buddy, like we lived in a group, like a house with a group of guys and we all turned ours a certain way. So I turned mine to the left. A buddy of mine turned his to the right. A buddy of mine took his completely off. And then another guy just left Oops. it regular but yeah we always did that it was kind of funny do you think it needs more yeah oh yeah you want to saturate like you need to fill this no 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 not vinegar oh okay you want to yeah. like fill it with water let's line them up a little bit and then organize this yeah the normal dye kits come with like other colors but i think these are just like supposed to be like dino colors yeah because i remember i used to flip them i yeah. used to do half and half so yes. i thought i was so cool yes my brother was really good at them. Well, this little guy turned out pretty cute. <laughs> How's yours doing? Yeah, I'm putting my arms on right now. <laughs> Can you hand me my sports? I don't 
What do you think, bug? What do you think? Cookies to make. Maybe a yummy little snack after dinner. Okay, here's the finished product of all of our cutie eggs. Such a cute kit. Loved it. Now, we're gonna make dinner. I'm gonna crack into these this week, but I'm not gonna do that tonight. I'm gonna make double eggs this week though. So excited about that. But while you're cooking, I am gonna make these yummy little Easter and Spro chocolate chip cookies. And they're so cute. So cute, so cute. Awesome. I know, I'm pretty tired too. I'm actually doing it all day, but I am sleepy. Are you out here cooking with your dad? Hi! Hi! Yummy. Are you talking? <laughs> They're cooking, and my cookies just got done. These look so yummy. Whoa. They look so yummy. We also have some french fries going. Um, also, you probably know this, but if you don't, fun fact, if you bake cookies and then when they cool, put them in a container with bread and it will keep them really soft and delicious. Fun fact. And they won't get hard. So, I don't know. I feel like maybe not everybody knows that, but it is a nice little hack. Dinner was good. I'm going to run a load of laundry. That's something I've gotten in the habit of doing since having Callan because there's so much laundry that comes with a baby. You just run smaller loads every night rather than just like letting it bulk up. And it's been a lifesaver. Another thing, we do a quick clean every night before bed. <coughs> and it saves so much time. And I wake up in the morning and smell so good. Don't you? Mm -hmm. Forgot to take these last night, but for the most part, I've been pretty good about them. Yeah, all I gotta do is just go back down the deal. Yeah, we do a quick clean every night, and it has saved me, honestly. I like waking up in the mornings and the house being clean, and just like starts your day off. We especially do it on Sundays, but um, through the week we do it, and I love it. My favorite, like brushing my hair out after it's been up all day. So it's amazing. I cannot believe how much my hair has grown within the last year. It's wild. We've got Goose's cage set up in our bed room because obviously like he's hurting and we want to be able to watch him through the night. Um, Callan is in his uh, last night here sleeping, and he went to sleep about 30 minutes ago, and, um, yeah, I'm going to put my jammies on, and we're gonna do a little skincare and go to bed, so, anyway, that's gonna be all for this weekend in my life vlog, hopefully you guys enjoyed, if you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below. I am really, really close to hitting a really big goal of mine, so make sure you subscribe. Also, if you feel the need to share it with a friend, 
somebody maybe that's um, you know going through postpartum as well somebody that's like minded whatever um, I would definitely appreciate that but anyway that's gonna be all for today's video I'll see you guys really soon in my next vlog. Bye. Anymore.